What's up everyone? Welcome back to Studio 13 where we are making nightmares real. Now, um, I do apologize last video for you not being able to see my face that well when I was actually reacting because it was so dark. However, as all of you may have noticed, in my past reacting videos, I would have a green screen hanging up in the background. However, this time, you're not going to see the green screen because I actually figured out how to use it and put a display up there. So I'm going to be doing that for the first time today, and um, which um, you might be able to, I don't know if you're able to see this on my end, but... I can see a little bit of a shadow or something on the screen, so something kind of wavy. I'm going to have to take a look into some lighting or something, maybe. But today, instead of reacting to just a scene from the movie Boogeyman, which, is, which was written by Stephen King himself, we are going to be reacting to the trailer this time. Plus... I figured that would be a good video since I've already been seen. Let's do something to with the same movie so that I can also test out the green screen. So please let me know what all of you think about this. And before we get too far in, be sure to drop a like and smash that subscribe button. Don't forget to hit the bell right beside where it says subscribe. That way you don't miss a single time I drop a new video. Also, don't forget to share and be sure to leave me some comments down below. All right, so today... We are going to be reacting to, like I said, the official trailer for the movie Boogeyman, which is going to be on the YouTube channel 20th Century Studios, written by Stephen King, also well-known horror book writer, um, wrote uh, classics like Pet Cemetery, Children of the Corn, and um, other iconic books and movies like that. So, um... Please let me know what all of you, once again, think of the green screen. Um, and before I forget, too, the link to the original video will be down below in the description if you want to check it out for yourself. When there are scary things we don't understand, our minds try to fill in the blanks. Sometimes the best thing to do is to face it. So this light is going to be completely silent like it is right now. Then gradually, it's going to start flashing until it's totally dark. So you can see that there's nothing to be afraid of. Okay? See? That's not so scary, is it? Just you, your sister, and me. So apparently, too, something that I just saw, never seen the show before, never watched one episode, um, but apparently the producer of the famous show Stranger Things, I'm guessing, also produced this, maybe? I'll have to look into that. I'm thinking about watching Stranger Things, maybe? I don't know. I'm kind of back and forth. You're doing okay. It's not real. It's okay. It's okay. It's all just in your head. Okay, so it looks like she went from being to either a counselor or a therapist or something to now being at, I'm guessing, her mother's house, maybe? Okay, let's see what goes on next. Okay, so it looks like with the scene that I uh, reacted to last week, one of them at least, or part of it. There's something in my room. You believe me, don't you? I'm trying to figure out, are those 
vines or those scratches all over the wall because those are a lot of scratches or whatever they are whatever that is that's a lot of it can't tell but let's see maybe there's no such thing as monsters you need to grow up i'm serious sawyer i need to be alone <laughs> That caught me off guard just a little bit, I'd say. Wow. Um, I was not expecting that. As many horror movies as I've seen, I was not expecting that to happen. You're both having these manifestations. What is this supposed to be? The thing that comes for your kids when you're not paying attention. Dad, you um, I'd say that thing's pretty strong. Um, definitely. You have to listen to me. Okay. Inside. I'm listening. <laughs> Sweetheart, let me handle it. So he turns around and um, gets yanked farther into the house. Um, wow. Alright, so I'm Definitely going to have to check this movie out. Um, very good looking movie, I'll say. And from what I've read too, this movie actually caused the critics, I believe it was. Maybe it was critics or people that... Re yeah, I think critics and people that remove, review movies are the same people, I believe. S but they actually got ran out of the movie. They got ran out of the room or wherever they were at during the screening of this movie. So I'm curious to know, like, those were only a little, a few bits and pieces, like from the trailer, obviously. But I would like to see what the whole thing's like. But I am curious to now watch the whole thing. And see what caused them to run out of theaters or screening room, wherever they were at. So, with that being said, don't forget to drop a like and smash that subscribe button. Don't forget to hit that little bell down beside where it says subscribe. Don't forget to leave me some comments down below. Let me know what you thought of this trailer. The um, fact that I started using green screen for the actual purpose now. And, um... What you think of Stephen King's movies. And if you are ready for next week and see what else I come out with. So, till next one, see you guys.